Today, a lot of hikers hike the mountains and all they see is the trail, they're walking. They don't look around and see the buckeye tree or the hickory tree or all the species of trees that are around them. They don't even see wild animals. When you walk with a quietness, you observe, you see all these things. We have some, so many uh, varieties that come up. Also, we have the wild blackberries, and we used to have the strawberries a long time ago when I was growing up. My mother would go out and uh, get a, a gallon of strawberries, and uh, they're entirely different to that of the, the uh, tame strawberries that we have today in these nurseries. And uh, the, the blueberries, we call them the huckleberries. Uh, huckleberry plants uh, are no more, hardly, in the woods. The water was so pure that uh, you could drink it just anywhere. You didn't have to boil it. You didn't have to worry about getting sick from drinking uh, polluted water. And, you know, when I was growing up, uh, so it was uh, very, very clean, very clean water. We've always uh, looked down on the soil because it furnishes everything. It doesn't only furnish, uh, it furnishes the timber, the food, uh, all things come from the ground. We, we honor just about everything because everything I understand is connected. All people are connected and plants, even uh, the animals of the forest and the, the fowl of the air, the fish of the sea, the reptiles. 